guys, Jen here from A and N Suds and Set Jumpy Scented Fragrance Will Spa in Sandy. And Austin and Sandy. And you probably hear that because I am doing a restock of my raspberry soap. My fresh raspberries. And this one I'm going to try to attempt to redo thank you. Um my last design with the blueberry seeds and the white and the off-white or the cream color. White. Going to do my stick blender wipe off from my last batch. Just got done making Forever Red. Leave my fingers away from that button. Oh, I have seen lots of people uh, post pictures of cleaning their stick blenders and uh, pushing the button and like chopping their fingers, like the ends of their fingers off. Yuck. Uh, so I'm always like, <laughs> My goat milk, my kale clay, and my clear oatmeal was in the bottom. We just added our cream. And with our last solution that has silk. <laughs> Holly calls it La Lint. So, so I'm always like, oh, okay. Makes sense. I'm gonna wait to add my fragrance till after I get my colors in. Cause I wanna do a drop swirl. Oh, hey Sandy. I got gloves on. Can't get So I'm gonna divide this off. The majority will be in these two. And then this part will be white. Scrapey, scrapey. You have to wrestle around like a bunch of dogs. Did you get it mean to you? Go on in the living room. You alright? No. I don't think it was on purpose. No. No. I think that looks good. Oh, everybody's mad. Yeah, everybody's mad. No. <laughs> you can put, um, like, two scoops. I think two scoops so should be good. Try to keep them from sticking to the spoon. They'll stick when you do that. And then this one. I rewatched my old video to see what did we do? What I did. Boys. So we did red, purple. Okay, I'm gonna have to pause you guys a minute. Okay, now that I've really made my kids mad. We're gonna see how that color turns out. All right, that one is good. Let's mix up our white. And 
I didn't clean my stick blender off last time. I watched. It's pretty wherever the bar went. It's pretty stinking close, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Alright, that's good. I think it's pretty. Alright, we gotta put this stuff in. <laughs> Thank you. Now we got to add our scent. We put just a little bit in that one. Oh, that smells so good. Mm -hmm. I, need mm -mm, I have one. You give me one from, I guess, the lie you rinsed out. Such a pretty color. Mm -hmm. That is a pretty A lot of people they'll message me and they'll say how did what color did you use and I'm like well <laughs> I mixed a bunch of stuff. I a bunch, yeah I mixed a bunch of crap together and that is what I come up with so pretty such a I don't know not vibrant but like deep mm -hmm. color I don't know it's pretty and our blueberry one. Even though it's raspberry soap, I know, yeah, whatever. I don't have raspberry scenes. Can you even get raspberry <laughs> scenes? Don't think they're not going to be that pretty if you do. It looks good. Oh, sorry. Yeah. going to take my spoons out. Oh, it smells so good. It really smells good. Can you guys see what I'm doing? Let's start out with the raspberry. What, I wonder what color that is. What do you think? Um, start out with the little layer in the bottom. Kind of a plum. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It almost looks like a heart up there in that corner. It does. And the white is just the accent color. Sort of just to make the other ones pop out. I think sometimes soap's made with white and uncolored. It's so pretty. And you all know how I do my drop swirl. Slow and steady. I don't drop it from way up high. Some lady messaged me and said I was I taught her how to do a good drop swirl. Awesome. Yeah. I don't pour in big sick. Because the higher you pour it, the more likely it is to swirl together and not stay separated colors. I 
if that makes sense. But if you don't pour high enough, then it just layers. And yeah, it's just a, a fine line. You'll figure it out. What works best for your recipe. Pretty. Mm -hmm. I like this soap. Now as I get up top with less than I do pour a little bit higher, because it's by now the soap is thickening up on me and bloop bloop. using it to wipe my hands off, right? <laughs> You're all thumbs today. Oh my goodness. I know. Clumsy, clumsy. I'll smack it down. Okay, I've done beat my soap. Let's see. This stuff comes through more so. Than the others. Like it's already almost covered the top of the soap, anyways. So we'll just go ahead and get it on there. Smell good. Mm -hmm. oh, there's that one. We'll do the white last because I have the least amount of it. Let's just swirl it. Chopstick. Yeah. Because it'll keep the colors where it's got the seeds mm -hmm. separated. Lastly, but not least, wait. lady come in the dollar store that I tell you and ask me how much uh, it cost me to get started bunches get okay, because she wanted to make soap um, and sell because she was not making enough money mm -hmm. to I guess support what all you know she needed to do and mm -hmm. she was honey. Oh, honey. What? She did. She was asked me uh, how much. She was like, "Are you serious?" Yep. And 
Yeah. It was... I, I, I explained to her, you know, making for friends and family, you know, not to sell, um, that she could definitely do it, um... Cheaper. Yeah. Then, um, but, you know, if she wanted to sell be able to sell it, you know, she needed to be able to buy and get her price, you know, cost of materials down. Mm -hmm. And I explained it all to her and she was really nice because, you know, anybody that wants to start, that's fine, but I'm not going to lie and sugarcoat it and say, you know, oh yes, it's easy. And cheap. Right, and cheap. And that's why I don't do it, I just come out Yeah. And she was like, um, so I don't know if she's going to do it or not, you know. Yeah. I think that's great if she can. And I told her, I, I said, you see, I'm still working, don't you? <laughs> and she said, well, yeah. Oh, that's cow. Because, you know, she was wanting to be able to make extra money. I think that's the problem with so many small businesses. They think that you know, within a month or two they're going to be able to quit what they're doing and just do that full time and you can't. No. And this has been three, three years. years in and you're still working. Oh yeah, and I still work. But it pays for itself, so I don't no, take any outside. money. Okay guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the making of this beautiful soap. Uh, I will attach the cutting to the end. See you in a minute. Hi guys, Jen here from Maine and Sense and Such. I'm be centered. We're back to cut my fresh raspberry soap. And here is the top. Very pretty. Let's trim off a little end piece. Pretty. Oh, yeah. That is pretty. Yeah, I really like it. Mm -hmm. I really like it. I didn't get any crackling in my white neither. Mm -mm. Which is great. Awesome. They started overheating and um, I happened to catch it um, when they were getting really hot and I uh, uh, uncovered all the soaps. Because I always throw like a little towel or something over top just to keep the air off of them. Not really to insulate them but just to keep air off the top of the soaps because it helps keep down soda ash. Mm -hmm. And I happened to go check on them and spritz the tops with alcohol. And yeah, they were like super hot. And I was like, oh boy. Oops. Uncover them all. And I didn't get any soda ash, so. Yay! My top. You have to give it a minute to focus. Even though I can't really see what it's doing, I just know after so many times of doing it and watching the video mm -hmm. that it takes it a I minute to, to focus. When I watch them, it does focus if you take them. Give it just a second. Yeah, give it just a second and it'll focus. Which that's what I like about that camcorder is the auto focus, you know, and and it's pretty fast about it. It doesn't take a long time to focus. I must cut that niblet in half. <laughs> it's a niblet. <laughs> a little swirly. A little swirly is right. I like the little swirlies. Just Here too. Instead of just, you Flat. know, yeah. Ooh, that's a pretty one. Yeah. 
This was the drop swirl, right? Mm hmm Yep. I like a drop swirl. I think it's pretty. You do it a lot. I do. Because I think it's pretty. There's another niblet. Yep. Mm. I just love the mm -hmm. little things in just that one spot. One section of the soap. A little wave. Beautiful. And the white really sets off the mm -hmm. other. It does. We did good. Yes, we did. And the color is pretty, pretty close. The other one is just a little bit darker, but that's okay. I like this one better. It's a little bit lighter. Mm-hmm. More of a raspberry than a purple. Mm-hmm. All right, guys. That's it. Thank you very much for watching. Catch you on the next video.